Hi, I'm Mike. I'm sitting here with Bobby Johnson from the South Sound Donut Users Group. Uh, hi, Bobby. Uh, thanks for uh, both standing up with me right now. Yeah, no problem. Over here was all sitting down. But, uh, you know, can you tell me a little, little bit about your user group and what you guys do? Sure. I'm actually, not even sure where South Sound is. <laughs> yeah, uh, South Sound refers to uh, the South Puget Sound. Okay. Uh, so we're about uh, 45 miles south of Olympia, Washington. Okay. Uh, and our user group meets uh, every second Thursday uh, of the month. Oh, wow. So um, you're two times a month? Uh, once a month. Oh, awesome. So every second. Every second Saturday. Yeah. Right? Sorry, it's been a long day. Yeah, no Numbers, problem. words, uh -huh. it's difficult. But okay, so every second? Uh -huh. Every second Thursday uh, of the month we, we get together and we typically have a presenter come down and that's what I'm responsible for is I usually book the presenters. Okay. Uh, and we have anywhere from 10 to 25 uh, local .NET developers. Uh, Olympia happens to be the capital of our state, so there's a lot of uh, state agencies that do .NET development. Okay. Uh, so that's mainly what our, our audience consists of, is, is state developers. When you say book, um, book speakers, mm -hmm. are you are you reaching out to the Microsoft uh, sometimes. team or something? Sometimes. I, I reach out to the local dev community. Uh, I'm pretty involved with the Seattle Alt.NET group okay. as well. Uh, which some of the, the more uh, high-level .NET developers are kind of involved in that community. Right. So I kind of cherry-pick those role. guys. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay, and, and so, um, like I said, I'm south, not, not too familiar with South Sound. I'm not sure what kind of uh, metropolitan area that mm -hmm. is. You said, but it, you said it's the capital of, of Washington, so, mm -hmm. which means I need to go back to fifth grade. <laughs> uh, but, uh, so, so it's a pretty decent size area. You said you typically get five to anywhere from 15 to 25 oh, people. from 15 to 25 yeah. people so it's a pretty good representation are they uh are they do you typically get repeat uh, attendees uh or we have a core group of members that show up at every meeting uh okay. and then kind of a, a roaming band of thousands oh, that okay. kind of show up whenever they show up do you you know and when you say thousands i mean you mean you have a pretty large um, registered Number base? Yeah, I believe our mailing list is something like 500 email addresses. Oh, wow. How many of those are actually live accounts that actually go to somebody? I don't yeah. know. <laughs> so. Yeah. so, the typical, like, if you said you're booking speakers, I'm assuming that you're typically doing a presentation style. Yeah. Okay. Um, do you ever do any hands on labs? Or? Uh, we do. Uh, I, I attempted to do a. Uh, uh, Randori style TDD session where basically we had one person uh, guiding somebody at a keyboard and every two minutes we'd switch off uh, and we worked our way through the string calculator. Those things are kind of rare for, for our user group. It's typically presentations. Okay, and, and uh, you know, you said that you kind of can cherry pick from the Alta Net group as, as being so close to an Alta Net group, uh, which, you know, they have a kind of a unique perspective on user groups themselves, is that if affected, uh, well I guess what I'm trying to say is, is the user group that you have, it's, it's a more of a core Microsoft user group, where it's going to be focused on more of the current Microsoft technologies, mm -hmm. is, that, is that a safe assumption? Uh, I would say the, the overall feel of the user group is, is more pragmatic Microsoft yeah. developers, so that, you know, they're probably using, still using .NET 3.5 or earlier. Right. Uh, but the content we try to bring down is introducing the new stuff coming out. Okay. Uh, so we're trying to keep them current and encourage them to try to branch out and, and try the new things as well. And uh, and also since you're since you're still working closer towards platform, not saying okay, let's we'll done that, guys. Or want to go off and we're going to do something off away from the mothership. You know? Sure. Uh, do, do you have uh, some help from uh, the developer evangelists to? Uh, at yeah. Microsoft, yeah, the, they will definitely uh, provide a software swag like that, uh, or even hook us up with maybe uh, developers in working groups that we were interested in hearing presentations oh, really? from sometimes. Yeah, yeah. That's, that would be pretty nice. It, it is really nice being so close to the Microsoft campus. It's a curse, yeah. too, but uh, being that close, we, we have a, a steady stream of, of really qualified uh uh, what's, the, what's the curse? What's the downside? Well, the the curse is you, we get a lot of uh, practice speakers. So, the, yeah, I'll come down and speak at your yeah. your user group, but what I'm really doing is I'm just reading my slides to you. and Getting a feel for when I go off to... Yeah, to the bigger yeah, conferences yeah. and stuff like that. Okay, well, 
Yeah, it's it's a it's a plus or minus. I always thought that um, music groups were a good test bed yeah. for speakers, but maybe if you're like being like the guinea pig lab for uh, uh -huh. for for Microsoft, that might be a little awkward. Um, and do you leverage anything? Uh, like I know that Microsoft offers uh, some, and I, I've taken advantage of some myself. User group support services. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm at, uh, are those, have you been able to take advantage of those? Like yeah, the, the, the main leader of our user group uh, is the regional INETA, uh, I forget what they call it, like sponsor or something okay. like that. Uh, and we have used INETA funds before to, to get speakers to our location, so like pay for yeah. gas and maybe lodging at times. So we have taken advantage so of that. So it has been a good thing for you. Yeah. Okay, good. All right, well, uh, thank you very much, Bobby, for talking All with right. me about the South Sound. SouthSound.net users group in Washington. Thank you very much.